Hey there, fellow adults in training. Welcome to the not-so-glamorous world of your 20s. You know, that magical decade we've all been waiting for since we were knee-high to a grasshopper? Buckle up, because this ride is about to get real. Remember when you were a teenager, dreaming of the day you'd finally hit your 20s? Ah, the sweet smell of freedom. No more curfews, no more asking permission to borrow the car, and definitely no more being told what to do. Right? Well, hate to break it to you, but reality's about to smack you in the face harder than a well-aimed snowball. So here you are, standing on the threshold of adulthood, ready to conquer the world in your pajamas while binge-watching your favorite show for the fifth time. But wait, what's that sound? Oh, it's just the echo of your parents' voices reminding you about that family dinner you promised to attend. Welcome to the first of many existential crises. Do I do what I want to do, or do I do what I have to do but really don't want to do? Let's paint a picture, shall we? It's Friday night. Your friends are blowing up your phone with plans for an epic night out. The siren call of adventure is strong. But wait, you've got that big presentation on Monday that you haven't even started. What do you do? Go out and risk showing up to work looking like a zombie with a PowerPoint? Or stay in, be responsible, and silently curse your friends' Instagram stories? Ah, the joys of adult decision-making. Now let's talk about one of the most anticipated perks of hitting your 20s, being of legal drinking age. Suddenly, you're allowed into those mystical places called bars and clubs. You can walk into a liquor store without feeling like you're pulling off a heist. It's exhilarating, isn't it? But here's the kicker. Just because you can doesn't mean you should. Sure, there's a certain allure to holding that first legal drink, feeling like the coolest cat in the room. But let me tell you a secret. Nobody looks cool with their head in a toilet at 3 a.m. And that hangover? It's not just a myth. It's a brutal reality that gets worse with each passing year. Trust me, your future self will thank you for learning moderation early on. The same goes for smoking. You might think it makes you look sophisticated or rebellious, but in reality, it just makes you smell like an ashtray and your wallet considerably lighter. Not to mention what it does to your health. Remember, being an adult means making choices that your future self won't hate you for. Now let's dive into the wonderful world of responsibilities. Remember when your biggest worry was whether your crush noticed your new haircut? Well, now you get to worry about exciting things like taxes, rent, and whether eating ramen for the fifth night in a row counts as a balanced diet. Spoiler alert, it doesn't. You'll find yourself Googling things like how to iron a shirt without an iron or is it normal for the washing machine to make that sound? And let's not forget the joy of realizing that those dishes won't wash themselves no matter how long you stare at them. But it's not all doom and gloom, I promise. Your 20s are also a time of incredible growth and self-discovery. It's when you start figuring out who you really are, beyond the expectations of your parents or the persona you crafted in high school. You'll make mistakes. Oh boy, will you make mistakes. But each one is a stepping stone to becoming the person you're meant to be. You'll learn the value of true friendships. Those late night conversations with your roommate about life, the universe, and everything. They're golden. Cherish them. And those friends who stick by you when you're at your worst. Keep them close. They're the family you choose. Your 20s are also the time to start building habits that will serve you well into the future. Start that savings account, even if you can only put away a few bucks each month. Learn to cook something other than microwave meals. Find a form of exercise you don't hate. Future, you will be grateful. One of the biggest challenges you'll face is learning to balance your dreams with reality. Maybe you always wanted to be a rock star, but now you're working a nine to five in an office. That doesn't mean you have to give up on your passion. Join a local band, write songs in your free time. The key is to find ways to incorporate your dreams into your life, even if they're not paying the bills, yet. Speaking of bills, let's talk about the joy of budgeting. Suddenly, you'll find yourself eyeing that fancy coffee and thinking, is this worth an hour of my wage? It's a sobering moment when you realize that money doesn't, in fact, grow on trees, and your parents were right all along about the importance of saving. But here's a pro tip. While it's important to be responsible with your money, don't forget to live a little. Set aside some fun money each month. Travel if you can, even if it's just a road trip to the next town over. Experiences are worth more than things, and your 20s are the perfect time to collect them. Now let's address the elephant in the room, social media. In your 20s, it can feel like everyone else has their life figured out. Your old classmate is getting married, your college roommate just got a promotion, and here you are trying to figure out how to adult. Remember this, social media is a highlight reel, not reality. Everyone is struggling with something, even if they're not posting about it. Instead of comparing yourself to others, focus on your own journey. Set goals for yourself, both big and small. Celebrate your victories, no matter how minor they might seem. 
Landed your first job? Celebrate. Finally figured out how to fold a fitted sheet? That's worth a victory dance, too. Your 20s are also a time for exploration. Try new things. Take that pottery class you've been curious about. Learn a new language. Travel to a place that scares you a little. The more you expose yourself to new experiences, the more you'll learn about what you truly enjoy and what you're capable of. Relationships in your 20s can be interesting. You might find yourself navigating the murky waters of dating apps, trying to figure out what you want in a partner. It's okay to take your time. Use this decade to learn about yourself in relationships. What are your deal breakers? What qualities do you value most in a partner? And remember, it's better to be single than in a relationship that doesn't serve you. As you navigate through your 20s, you'll also start to redefine your relationships with your family. Suddenly, you're relating to your parents as an adult. It can be a bit weird at first, but it can also lead to some of the most rewarding relationships of your life. And if you have younger siblings, prepare to become the cool older sibling who gets panicked texts about how to do laundry. One of the most important things to remember in your 20s is that it's okay not to have everything figured out. In fact, if you think you've got it all figured out, life is probably about to throw you a curveball. Embrace the uncertainty. Be open to changing your mind about things. The person you are at 20 might be very different from the person you are at 29. And that's not just okay. It's fantastic. Your 20s are a time for making mistakes, learning from them, and growing. It's about finding your tribe, discovering your passions, and slowly but surely becoming the person you want to be. It's about late nights and early mornings, about dreams and reality colliding, about figuring out how to be responsible while still maintaining your sense of wonder. So to all you 20-somethings out there, here's my advice. Be kind to yourself. You're doing better than you think. Take risks, but also take care of yourself. Save money, but also splurge on experiences. Work hard, but don't forget to play. Call your mom, she misses you. And most importantly, remember that your 20s are just the beginning. You've got a whole life ahead of you to figure things out. In the words of the great philosopher Blink1A2, nobody likes you when you're 23. But don't worry, it gets better. Your 20s might be messy, confusing, and sometimes downright terrifying, but they're also exciting, transformative, and full of potential. So buckle up, enjoy the ride, and don't forget to laugh at yourself along the way. Welcome to adulthood, kid. You've got this.